One of the best features of Yuzu is that you can use mods really, really easy. This can be anything from a simple level mod for Merry Odyssey, which removes some details. And it can also be a randomizer for Pokemon Let's Go, which is pretty amazing. So for this, you need two things. Of course, you need Yuzu Canary setup. For this, I got a guide, which I will link in the top right corner. If you have Canary set up, you need of course the game, and this should already be in your game library. As I have right here, I'm going to apply a mod for Super Mario Odyssey. And once you have this done, you need the actual mod of course. Myself, I am going to try out the Mario No Sash mod, which removes the moustache from Mario in pretty much any section of the game, which looks pretty hilarious. So you need to download a folder, and this is the actual name of the mod, which is Mario No Stash. And in here is a ROMFS folder. This folder actually has all the mod files in it, so if you open it, you can see all the modifications are to object data. So now go up to the folder where you can see the actual mod name. Make sure to open Yuzu and right click the game. Here click open mod data location. Once you're here, just drag and drop the mod you want to use. And now you can see in the roaming directory of Yuzu, of the actual game, right here I got the Mario No Stash mod loaded. Now once this is in place, you can go back to user canary, right click it and open properties. In here you can see with the add-ons, the patch name and here's the mod. It is a Mario No Search mod and if you want to disable or enable it, you can simply check or uncheck this box right here. So for example if you want to use multiple mods, you can just drag all of those to the mod location of your game. And you can manually enable and disable these, which is pretty great. So I'm going to have, have it enabled and if you make any changes here and press OK, it will reload your library, which is totally fine. Now once this is done, you are actually ready to open the game and enjoy the mod. Sadly, I can't include any gameplay because Nintendo really likes to take down any video, which includes gameplay or a soundtrack of any game they make. So I can't provide any gameplay and I hope you believe that it actually works. So just try it out yourself, get a mod from pretty much any location you want. A good location for this is Game Banana. That's the guide, I hope you enjoyed it and if it was useful be sure to let me know by dropping a like down below. Also comment what you thought of it, are there any tips, can I improve on something in this guide? Let me know and I will see you in another video.